accentuate of green color, like neon green, I think that would be a nice one. The back though is beautiful. Like pearly. Like pearls. Jess Labares, Philippines. Jess Labares from the Philippines and she is she's good. The only thing that I think that she lost in this competition is that her overall projection, I think she didn't give her best. It looks unnatural. Um, I don't know if she's so... Because for a beauty queen to really win a contest, she should be natural. And her walk should not be made up. Her smile should not be made up. It all comes... Should Everything should come out natural. Otherwise... She's beautiful. And the gown also, it did not much bring out the best of her feature. If she wore a red, a blood red gown, I think she could have, you know, pulled everything out, out and Andrea won. R. Singapore. Another red gown, guys. Ruffles. See, this is what I don't like with a gown like this, guys, is that if you put a lot of ruffles in front, it doesn't look like that you have a slit and it looks like your legs are shorter. It makes you look shorter, actually. Oh my god. Um. <laughs> Tron, Sweden. Oh, sweet. I like the gown. So this is a grey silver metallic. What's nice about this gown is a trail. It has a slip on arm, so and it's all um, sequined. So I like it. I like the overall projection of the gown and how she she walks in it. Yep, this gown is a nice gown as well. Remember, guys, that if you have the, the trail, put it in front. Taiwan, Republic of China. Another white gown. Why don't like the white gown, guys? Is that it doesn't bring much. The best of your beauty, the best of your body. Because I don't know, I just don't like the white gown. Silver gray, or if you're gonna be using the white gowns, make sure that it's really boom. It's really beautiful. Thai Priya Nyungli, Thailand. Wow. Thailand, watch for her. She's really beautiful. I like the gown, the gold one. Oh, wow. Yep. And the sleet on the side. Yep, brings out her body really sexy. And high slit. Yep, that's the number one um, of my favorite gowns. With a bare back. Picture. Perfect. Perfect. Wow. Wallet, United States of America. Oh. oh my god, what, what's going on? Is she having a hard time to walk? Oh yeah, oh my god. Oh my god, dry your hand. Oh, oh my god. Uh, yeah, she's having a hard time walking. Maybe it's because of the heels, or maybe she just did a surgery or what. Oh my god, no. Oh no. No. She needs more 
practice and she should hold more of her skills in the team. I like the pink. I like purple color and I like this violet leather. It's a violet gown. It's like metallic violet. Beautiful. High slit. I like that. Although it's um ordinary cut and everything, but the call itself makes her face and body pop out. So Plus the high slit again. I'm going under and this time wow. I feel there's no one to save me. This all and nothing's really got a way of yeah. driving me crazy. I need somebody to know, somebody to hear, somebody wow. to help. So what do you think guys? I think the one who stand out is Thailand, Mexico, um, Australia, Philippines, Vietnam. Ladies and gentlemen, big round of applause for the evening gown competition! So guys, you've seen, so that concludes our vlog reaction for the evening competition of the Miss International Queen. What do you think? Who were your favorite candidates and who do you think guys have the best and the most beautiful gown and the most beautiful projection and overall bearing in that portion of the Miss Universe International or rather the Miss International Queen 2020. So let me know guys, put on your comment down below my video and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel guys and um, I hope that you would also continue watching my forthcoming video as well and um, I hope that you would have a great night tonight and I hope that you would have a very nice day ahead of you and tomorrow. So see you on my next video. Have a good night.